Hi everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will see VO2 Max inaccurate in your all new Apple Watch Series 10. So here is how you can simply fix this issue. So the common reasons the that can cause the issue of VO2 Max reading. So the first one is inconsistent reading. Second one is heart rate descriptions. Okay, and third one is calibration problem. And the final one is limited workout type. Okay, so here is a fixes that can help you to fix the issue. So the step one is to reset fitness calibration data. Okay, so you can simply open the watch app in your iPhone and then go to privacy. Here you can simply click on reset fitness calibration data. Here you will find at the downside. Okay, the user experience in accurate reading should consist resetting their fitness calibration data. It can be done through these settings. Okay, the step two is to calibrate your watch. So perform a proper calibration by taking brisk walks outdoor can help stabilize a more accurate baseline for VO2 max calculation. Okay. The third one is monitor activity type. Ensure that your workout are locked correctly and consider adjusting your activity type to those recognized by the VO2 max estimate. Okay. The fourth one is consult a professional. So if discrepancies persist, it may be a beneficial to consult with a healthcare professional or undergo for a formal VO2 max set test in a lab settings to compare result and understand individual fitness level. So these are the steps that can help you to fix this issue.